Christmas is Monday, so and yesterday was the solstice, and so a lot of people are calling people saying, you know, we want donations so that we can do, you know, special Christmas surprises for people. And I think that's kind of why, um, you know, that's kind of how me and, and Janice got on the conversation of the parrot, sort of, in, the, in terms of she's saying, well, I'm going to make them buy you a parrot. Um, you know, and I was like, yeah, that, that, that is entirely full of shit. And if you make me believe that, I'm going to end up killing people. <laughs> and, um, well, I didn't quite say it like that, but it's kind of how it came across. And, um, you know, so I, I sit here by my window where I'm running and I see Sherry come out here with her little shit machine. And, um, you know, that was one of those, those, you know, the organization that calls and says, well, you know, if you're looking for some place to donate at the end of the year, there are these people, we could get them a, you know, support animal, but they won't discuss anything other than a local, um, locally bred dog or a cat and um, that is because the money it's it's not about giving giving somebody it's about giving a defective dog that cannot be potty trained to someone that no one will listen to if they say look I did everything I could and this dog could not be trained because I never see bug poop or pee outside I, ever 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 in all the times that I've seen looked outside I have never seen bug poop or pee. Ever. Sherry just brings that dog out to be nosy. But anyway, I was like wandering around yesterday just thinking about stuff. And, um, you know, it's Christmas. What if a Christmas miracle came and somebody just decided to give me like an extreme makeover in my house? And they, they went to Mattress Firm and bought a bed and they went to that whatever that store is that advertises in the... Um, paper, you know, the red plum, and says, you know, um, that, uh, you know, they'll get me a, you know, brand new couch, and new furniture, and make this place look real nice, and, you know, all new stuff, because, uh, you know, all this stuff that they're begging for, say, so, oh, no, no, she doesn't deserve anything like that, you know, because somebody that's, that's tried their damnedest to work, despite the fact that work has been designed around, you know, we put up with all kinds of shit. We put up with Willie sitting in my back yard uh, where he's visible writing me up for running in the house. They literally kicked somebody out for running for, with scissors one time, like back in the 70s or something. I mean, we, we let people like that work, but we don't let me, people like me work no matter what we try, you know. And at this point, I know better than to try to work because I'll end up killing people. But, um... You know, somehow, somehow that's always my fault, and I'm not the worthy poor. So, anyway, so the whole parrot thing is like, you know, shut up and get out of my office. Shut up and hang up the phone. Don't call me again. Oh, are we here to talk about Holly's parrot again? You know, because that's, that's kind of it. One of these days I'm actually going to buy a parrot. I, 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 I think that's going to happen. But, you know, between now and then, you know... We want to we wanna give one of these shit bags a special gift because, you know, it's not about who deserves it. Because if it was about who deserves it, I would live in a castle. But it's about, like, doing something with the money of people who earned it for somebody that just has never done anything but sit on their thumbs. And, um... You know... Everybody needs to be cheered up so they don't go around psycho killing and stuff. But, you know, how many people has Sherry killed? And they still gave her a dog. <laughs>